Hey everybody, Anthony from Anthony in the Wild here, and today I am reviewing from Ohuhu, that's O-H-U-H-U, -H -U, the Canopy Weight Down Bags. Uh, I received this product for free or a heavily reduced price for my honest and unbiased opinion. And of course with me you know that's exactly what you're going to get is my honest and unbiased opinion. Uh, if this video you find it helpful, please like it, share it, uh, get the word out on these guys. As well as if you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them. I'll be happy to respond. Uh, you can also follow me at Anthony Fierro, that's F-I-E-R-O, last name, first name Anthony, on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram for further wonderful product reviews that I do, as well as a more detailed product review on this item here. But let's get to it. This is the Ohuhu. Uh, they're weight down bags, um, and they're very cool. I will take a closer look here. Let me get in. It's uh, tall, so I want to push it back far enough where you guys can see in here. Uh, this is it, uh, 360 view. That's the back side of it. It's basically just a, a big uh, uh, you know, bag that you fill full of sand or rocks to weight down whatever you like. Uh, intended purpose would be you know, the canopies. Uh, and I'll tell you what I do is uh, we have a, every time we go camping, uh, I do bring along, especially with the family anyway, when I go camping with them, we bring along one of those um, canopies we bought at the uh, large chain uh, store. And um, it sets up and we go over and put it over usually the picnic table. And that way, you know, we've got one area if we're out and there's not a lot of shade or something. And we've got one area that's always covered. If you need shade, it's there as well as if it starts raining, we've got somewhere we can shove everything to keep it dry. Um, but the problem is, is we're always camping on the lake or the river, or whatever, especially with the lake um, and the ocean. The wind is, you know, gets strong and those things will blow over. They act as a big, uh, you know, the, the it, wind catches underneath that, that canopy top and uh, it'll take it for a ride. So uh, it comes with, you know, tie downs and stuff like that. But that, it just what a pain. These are awesome. OK, uh, you just fill them full of sand or rocks uh, and attaches around the poles of it. As you can see, it's pretty tough here take this velcro strap off sorry about the camera action there I apologize about that but now then how to manhandle it um, this is it it's got two sides a zippered uh, top and a zippered top it has a nice handle here uh, for carrying uh, which is handy when this thing is full because when it's full it's heavy uh, but it's seamed in the middle okay so it's two separate sides you got you know this side and that side seamed in the middle and what you do is you just simply fill these and then put them around, you know, the um, canopy or whatever your weight net goes in the middle. It sits around it and then Velcro shut uh, with the handy dandy uh, oh hoo hoo Velcro strap. And um, that's going to hold it down. Uh, like I said, the, the strap here, uh, that's going to go, like I said, the pole goes in the middle, the strap goes around it and the bags to hold it in tight. And this sucker is going nowhere. Um, I've I've heard of people filling them full of rocks, uh, which is a good idea. I just went to uh, one of the large box store uh, home improvement centers and uh, picked up uh, playground sand is what it's called there. I've seen it at other places. It's what they just call fine sand. You can get a huge bag of 20, 40, 50 pounds uh, for relatively cheap, um, which I like more than, than the rocks uh, because I don't want to tear the bags, the, the Ohuhu bags. I don't want to tear them up. So uh, I went and got sand, put them in there. We went out, uh, was it yesterday, day before, and uh, we, we were just out for, for you know, day off, hanging out uh, by the lake. We had a canopy up and uh, hooked these up. Now, we didn't have any strong winds or anything come, but I wanted to see how it worked. And once I said, when these things are full and you put them in there, it's sturdy. You know what I'm saying? That, that it, it isn't going anywhere. Um, a little helpful tip from old Mr. Anthony. And if you look right here down at the bottom too, sewn in is a grommet. So uh, you got other uses for that. You can tie down to it as well. These things can lay flat. The possibilities are endless. Anything that you need to, um, you know, and I've seen people use bags like this as, as a tie down rather than wrapping around the legs. If you were using like a tarp or something, uh, you know, strung up as a, as a shelter, you could always, you know, tie off to the grommet there. Uh, with the bags laying down and it's going to work just just the same uh, but for me we're using it for the for the canopy that we have um, but yeah don't uh, I wouldn't suggest putting rocks in it um, because like I said that, that could tear the bag up uh, and, and it, it's not you know solid so it, it's going to be weighted a little weird what I did was I said I got the sand and I'm always saving bags from products and different things like that my wife thinks I'm some kind of hoarder uh, but it came in handy finally 
And what I did was I filled the sand up in plastic bags. And at first, and I had ones that were long cylinder ones like this that were actually a little longer, worked perfectly. And I had about a dozen of them. This product comes not just with what you see here, but three others just like it. It comes with a total of four. Um, so I had, I filled them full of sand and put them in there overnight or something. If you're camping, the sand, you know, inside it might get a little damp and you don't want it inside the bag getting damp. And then you come home, you try to pack the bags away, there's sand in it and everything. So if you don't have bags that fit it perfectly, like I just happen to have, get a garbage bag. Um, you know what I'm saying? Or a newspaper bag. And once the newspaper comes, that's good. Just something to put the sand in inside of it. Uh, so you don't end up with sand all over, you know, your old hoo hoo bags. Keep them nice and clean and they'll last forever. So another great product from Ohuhu. I love it. I definitely give it five stars. I recommend it to any and everybody who goes camping and out in the wild and different things like that. You're always going to need some kind of uh, sandbag, tie down bag or something like that. And this, if you just need one, you've got it. If you need four, you got it. It comes in a pack of four. They're perfect for the canopies. Like I said, if you're using a tarp as some kind of shelter, it's perfect to you know, tie off to that as well, the, the weight it down. Uh, it's great. Just don't be that guy that fills it full of sand right into that bag. Listen to old Anthony, all right? Don't do that. Um, put something in there. If nothing else, like I said, a garbage bag, fill it full to the top, you know, tie it off. Keep your Ohuhu bags nice. That way when you're done, you pull them out, your sand's in a bag, you know what I'm saying? You put it out in your garden or save it till the next time you go camp and throw it over in the corner, out in the garage, whatever. But keep your bags nice and neat and that way, you know, you can pack them up for the next time and they're ready to go. Your sand's ready to go and everything's nice, neat, clean and in order, which old Anthony in the wild likes when everything's nice, clean and in order. So don't be that guy or lady for that matter. Don't do it. Uh, but this is Anthony from Anthony in the Wild. Go get your Ohuhu bag, all right, for yourself, your friends, families, loved ones, people you hate it, that matter. They're priced right. You get four of them, and they rock. They are awesome. And then I mentioned this handle here, too, which is cool because when you fill this sucker full of sand, it might not look like much. But, uh, you know, saying you're dragging this thing from the car or the uh, at truck to, you know, where you're setting up. Uh, you know, like I said, get the kids to do it because <laughs> they're heavy, so. Um, this is Anthony from Anthony in the Wild. We'll see you in the wild with your Ohuhu canopy uh, sandbag tied down bags. Great bags. And uh, we'll see you there. Thank you.